a little bit about how our bodies move and learn and how we can, how our brains can help us slow our bodies down and speed them up. Have you ever thought about your body and brain working together as a car engine? Some car engines go really fast like race cars. There are also car engines that go really slow. And there are car engines that move just right. Our bodies can work like that too. When our bodies are moving fast, like a fast car engine, we might have a hard time paying attention, sharing with our friends, listening to directions from our parents or our teachers, or keeping our hands to ourselves. Okay, you guys, let's see if you can practice moving really fast. Everybody get up, stand up, we're gonna practice. And go as fast as you can. And now let's do some big jumps. All right, and wiggle all around. Okay, great job. One more time. And go as fast as you can. And now let's do some big jumps. All right, and wiggle all around. Okay, great job. When our bodies are moving slow, like a very slow car engine, we might feel tired or even sad. Slow engines might have a hard time paying attention, sitting up, playing with friends, or even being kind to others. Who's ready to try out our slow engines? Now we're gonna try going really slow. When our bodies are moving just right, that is when it's easiest for us to learn and focus. Just right engines and bodies help us to feel good, stay focused, make good choices, and be a good friend. Who's ready to try out our just right engines? Now, let's practice when our engines are just right and we can play with our friends and we can learn and we can do all of the fun stuff that we like to do at home and at school. So when your engines are just right, your eyes are looking at where they should look, your body is pointed to where it should look, and you are focused and you can pay attention. Let's try marching in place. Show me those ready to learn, just right bodies. All right, you guys, great job. One way that we can help our bodies and engines run just right is to make sure we move during our day. Let's do some animal stretches and see how we feel. Elephant stretches. Stand with your feet apart, lean over, and use your arms as the elephant's trunk. Bear walks. Put your hands on the floor and walk like a big, strong bear. Snake stretches. For this one, lie down on the floor on your belly and slither across the floor like a snake. Breathing hippo stomps. Do your biggest, strongest stomps, but also let out a big breath with each stomp. Kangaroo hops. I know you can all jump up and down like a kangaroo. Give it a try. Remember, you have lots of tools to change your engine and help your body. You can practice going slow, fast, and just right. 